Welcome back. So starting out the week, there's a bunch of different uh, sanding going on on various different plugs. So that's uh, keeping everybody fairly busy. But we've got some more milling to do and a few other things going on. So you'll see uh, what's coming up here in a second. So I can't recall if I actually showed you this one before, but we actually milled um, a plug for this one in reverse of what we're doing now. And so this one actually is going to go straight to a mold, so it won't be actually a plug. And this one is just uh, an insert that will go into the keel, and it's uh, where the aileron controls come through from the outside to the inside of the cabin. Now, last time you saw these uh, plugs for the uh, left and right side cowling in foam, so now they've been glassed and uh, sprayed with putty, so they're ready to go up on the mill and get their final milling. And this one was finished on Friday, so this is the uh, tray for the uh, main air intake, the sort of uh, rear half of it, so that's in foam ready for glass. And here's the uh, aileron insert um, one again, so that's finished and cleaned up there and that's ready to have uh, a layer of glass put on that. So here you see the uh, left side cowling um, plug under the mill right now. And it's just running with a, a short uh, flat mill and just doing the main sort of field area there. And in this one, I think I had it set up for like a, a 10 thousandths step over. So when you're running a curve like that, you keep the step overs together nicely and, it, and you end up with a nice smooth finish. And there you can see the control panel there while it's running away. It tells you how fast it's running and all the XY axis and all that sort of stuff that's going on over there. And there you can see it's doing a nice job, and that actually came out really well. There's a, you know, quite a lot of different flange areas on there, so a um, bunch of different tool paths that need to be run to complete that one. And here it is, a little bit further along, just starting out on the area of the cowling that is actually the top surface of the wing, because uh, the cowling kind of folds over and, and meets up with it, with the wing there. And now we're doing the same surface, but actually on the right side plug. So that one uh, got run today and pretty much finished. This just has a couple more paths to be done um, to finish it off in the morning. So that one will be uh, getting ready for sanding uh, soon. So it's another couple of plugs out of the way and fully milled. And here's the lower dash plug again, and um, this was milled last week, so here it is with a guide coat sprayed on. And so that one's ready for some hand sanding. And likewise, there's that center stack that uh, goes between the center console and the lower dash. So that one with a guide coat, that's also ready for sanding. Here's the right side door frame uh, that got primed uh, last week. So here it's getting its uh, sanding with 180, and then uh, once that's done, it'll be up to uh, I think it's 320, and then 400 before it'll go um, for waxing. And there's Devin uh, spraying a guide coat on um, that left side uh, cowling plug, and you can see just put it on very light there. So uh, when we sand it off, you can see if there's any low spots there because they remain uh, with a pink color. And here is that. Uh, intake tray so that one now has got glass um, Roberto and Chris got on that quickly this afternoon and got that one done and here's the plugs for the upper door skins um, so both of those now have been fully waxed and they're um, getting their uh, rubber profile put on those so they'll be ready to have a mold pull shortly and now it's the end of day today and here's Zach just finishing off the first uh, round of sanding or actually I guess the second round of sanding on this uh, door frame so tomorrow I'll be on the other one. And Roberto and Chris again in this afternoon, you already saw they uh, glassed that uh, other plug and now they're just uh, sanding here on the uh, firewall plug. So they've got a bunch of different uh, sanding they'll be doing for us this evening. So it's good that they keep things moving along. And I've been preparing the next set of uh, plugs to be milled. So here are the uh, the new design for the seat frames um, or the seat mounts 
so these are just obviously going to be carbon fiber so it's the front ones on the left and the rear ones on the right so here's the front ones close up and you can see they're going to lay up you know very simply um nothing complicated there no worries about you know two-piece molds or anything like that and there's the rear ones and this is the one for the three seats in the back option I actually have a, a different setup for if we have two seats in the back but we're not going to lay those up just yet and here you can see this is the uh, front ones and I've actually put both of them together sort of um, you know opposite each other and made it a single uh, plug so and that'll mill up nicely for us and again saving an extra plug and likewise here's the ones um, for the rear seats as well so those will be um, having platforms uh, built tomorrow and then probably milled before the end of the week and also coming up this is the air intake scoop and so uh, I had to make a couple little changes and put like a nice airfoil on the lip of this one uh, before it was ready to go so but now it is uh, ready and there you can see uh, that's uh, looking from the underside of it actually this is prior to me putting the airfoil on there this is an old old one but anyway um, and here it is with the flanges and stuff all put on there ready to go up on a platform so that'll probably be uh, getting milled uh, this week as well so that's our update for the first half of this week thanks again for watching